Good afternoon and welcome to the Chart of the Week video with me, David Madden. Today's date is Tuesday, 23rd of June 2020 and the time has just gone 12.06 British Summer Time. And this week's Chart of the Week is the US Small Cap 2000, as we call it here at CMC, on our platform, or the Russell 2000, as you might know it. Uh, before we get into the finer details, let's look at the wider trend of the last few months, which has clearly been to the upside. Since late, since late March through the last few months, it's been a solid upward trend. In fact, in June, it hit a three-month high. We've managed to pull, pull, back, pull back lower from that level. It does appear to be moving higher again. We could be looking at retesting the 200 moving average, and maybe we could potentially look to retest uh, the highs of early June. So if you take a look here at the kind of precise price action, we can see here that the market's been in a nice upward trend for the last few months. If you look, we're currently trading around 14.52, 14.50, 51 rather. If you look to press on higher from here, we could look at retesting this red line here, which is a 200 moving average. Notice how it previously acted as both support and resistance in the not too distant past. So therefore the metric is likely to be of importance in the future, but there are no guarantees. If you press on higher from here, we could be looking at retesting the trend moving average, which comes into play at 14.78. If we go beyond that, we could be looking at testing the high seen here in, um, in early June in around 15.40. If on the flip side, we do have a move to the downside uh, and, we, and we push on lower, we could look at heading back toward this blue line here, the 50 moving average, and that comes into play at 13.42. We can see here uh, that it acted, acted nicely as support uh, in the middle of June, so it's likely that that metric um, would act as support again, but obviously there are no guarantees. And if you do trade below 13.42, we can look at heading back down towards the mid-June low of 13.13. And if you do have a decent break below 13.13, that could, could take us back down to the next you know, big, kind of big number, which would be 1,300. Now, if you are going to be trading the... Um, the Russell 2000, I would keep an eye on what's going on on the S&P 500, just, just as, a, as, a, as to, to um, tie in with, with Dow theory, because one of the tenets of Dow theory is that the averages must confirm each other. And what that essentially means is that markets that are, that are, that are similar, or that have a, a reason to be correlated, tend to move in the same direction around the same time. So we can, as we saw previously, the Russell 2000 has been an upward trend since late March, as has the S&P 500. The S&P 500 uh, is slightly in a stronger position though because it's, it's actually back, it's, it's actually above its respective 50-day, apologies, it's, it's back above its 200-day um, moving average. So, so the S&P 500 is in quite decent shape. It's, it appears to be uh, look, set to retest the June highs. So if the S&P 500 retests its June highs, the, 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 your, there's an increased likelihood that the Russell 2000 will increase, that will, that will look to retest its, uh, its June highs. Now, if you are going to tra trade the Russell 2000 or any of the US indices or any even of the uh, US currency pairs, it is worth noting today that later on at 2.45 British summer time, we have the flash manufacturing reports, uh, that we, we have the flash PMI reports covering US services and US manufacturing. It is worth noting that the French, German and UK flash services and manufacturing period my reports this morning were all well received uh, they all largely they all they all came in uh, they all were well received they all showed decent very big improvements um in in june in comparison with the month of may uh, i want to thank you for listening to this to this video please keep tuning in stay safe have a good trading week and good luck